Thanks for joining us at 5 o'clock with some breaking news. Two security officers who shot and killed a man on DeMumrian Street in June will not be criminally charged. And that man's family believes the shooting was unjustified. Our chief investigative reporter, Jeremy Finley, joins us. Okay, so Jeremy, you've looked into questions about the shooting. This essentially clears the security officers. It does, Lauren. The DA's office says the security officers were essentially protecting the public at the time. And they're not the only ones not being prosecuted in this case. When Patrick Charles opened fire in this parking lot off Demumbrian Street in June, it sparked two police investigations. After he started shooting, he was then shot and killed by security officers Beck Wandre and Kelvin Torres. Charles's family, one of the security officers charged, saying Charles was trying to protect his fiance and sister after he got into a fight with another man. You were shooting open fire on him like he's open prey. Why? Like, that was senseless. But in this letter to Metro Police obtained by WSMV4 Investigates, the DA's office says they will not prosecute, saying that Charles was presenting a danger of death to others and the security officers were stopping the threat. The other police investigation that night into Jack Bird, a civilian who owns another security company who picked up Charles's weapon after the shooting, took it to his car and kept it there until police arrived, raising questions about tampering of evidence. Bird was also wearing a police vest, although he is not police. The DA's office declined to charge him saying that they couldn't prove that Byrd intended to tamper with evidence, that he instead preserved the weapon. If you'd like to read the deputy district attorney's letter explaining his decision not to prosecute, we have it for you right now on our app. Lauren, back to you. All right, love all the extra info. Jeremy, thank you. More break.